haven't really decided on like, a direction for my channel, um, but one of the things that I'm interested in is fashion, so I figured I would take advantage of the long weekend and just make a quick video for whoever's watching. So, um, this is going to be my sort of patriotic lookbook, and I know like, America's got tons of problems, but um, I just wanted to celebrate this year, and I feel like the country's in better hands, so it's worth celebrating. Um, Anyway, I'm going to start with this t-shirt, which is supposed to be like a moisture wicket, but I don't know, I feel like it's too cute to work out in, so, yeah. It's just a cute, um, light pink, like, flag t-shirt, and I don't know if I can show my skirt, but if you wanted to work out in it, you could wear, like, a skirt or something. I can't really see that much. But anyway, that is look number one. Look number two is also super casual. So it's just this um, red, white, and blue striped t-shirt. And I paired it with some jeans, or actually these are shorts. I don't know if you can see where they cut off. But um, I tried to like, get my sneakers in. They're just um, like this old pair of Adidas I got like a few years ago. Um, but yeah, that's it for look number two really easy. So if anyone was wondering, here's a closer look of um, my Adidas. <laughs> yeah. Um, I wore these for like, the first look as well, so just figured I would include them. I call this next look Three Stripes for the Win, and you'll see why in just a second. So the top is this red Team USA t-shirt. Um, it's actually not like moisture wicking or anything, unfortunately. But um, it was on sale, and here you can see the three stripes. Um, it's kind of hard to show like the entire length of the pants and like shoes and stuff. So um, I guess I'll just show them like sitting. Um, but here you go. So here are the shoes that are wore with us. I can't really look, look really clean, but um, I got these during COVID, so like, um, I didn't really wear them out too much, but now that it's over, of course, it's like, they started getting dirty, and that made me sad, but, anyway, um, so as I was saying before, the Team USA store had a sale, I guess it was like when they announced that the, Olymp the Olympics were canceled, or postponed, so I got this really cute lanyard, and it's reversible, so like, I usually wear it on the blue side, but it's also red. Um, it's got little flags all around it. It says Team USA. And it's really good for like your keys or ID or anything like that. It looks so like official in this video. <laughs> I've never seen it like on me. Um, and then, this was also on sale. It's a little notebook. So I thought when I get it. And I thought it was gonna be a tiny, like half the size of it. Like that it was gonna be a really small like notebook that they wanted $20 for. Um, I forget what I paid, but it was really affordable, and it turned out to be like a full size book, so that's really nice. And I kind of thought about getting like a monogram sticker for it, but um, I actually haven't used it yet, so it's like blank pages, and quite a lot of pages too. If they're still available, I would like recommend getting one, because it's really cute. Um, and Philadelphian that I am proud Philadelphian that I am. Um, this is actually not necessarily patriotic, but I just noticed that my um, Philly duffel bag is like red, white, and blue. So it kind of goes with the theme. And since this whole look was about like fitness and like the gym, I figured it was like a perfect way to tie that in. Anyway, um, I think I have two more looks and that's the end of this video. This next look is a little more put together, um, which I think would make it I guess go well with like an office setting. So maybe if you wanted to wear something nice on the day before or like the Friday before work. What am I saying? The the last day of work before the weekend. Anyway. Um so there's plenty of red, white, and blue as you can see. And then I just like tucked it in a pair of dress pants and um you won't be able to see the shoes anyway, but 
very simple, but still nice. And these earrings, I think, look really good with it, too. I don't know if the camera is focusing, but... Yeah, pretty simple. And I'll be back with the next look. This was supposed to be the last look, but I had a new idea, so it'll be a bonus. Um, but first, I want to show these cute little, um, they're not hair ties or whatever, like hair clips. So, um, like one year I wore like all three of them, like red, white, and blue, my hair. And then the yellow one is because I wore like the yellow and blue for like Sweden's National Day one year. Um, but yeah, anyway. Um, I don't know if I've outgrown them, because, but anyway. Um, it might be too much with the earrings, because I feel like these are like enough of a statement piece on their own. But I did just want to show them, because I think they're so cute. Anyway, uh, this look is a dress, because I can't do like a fashion book, lookbook thing and not include a dress. So, I don't know how much you can see, but there's like a really cute, like, like standing on my tippy toes. It's like a really cute like ruffle detail at the bottom, which kind of gives us like a little bit of a mermaid look. But um, I decided not even to like try to <laughs> wear the heels with this because you won't be able to see them. Uh, but I'll show them in just a second. So I have these that I would wear them with. And um, obviously this is like more of a day look, but you could wear like regular heels. Um, for a night out. Um, and I would struggle with red just because I think it, it's nice to have that like pop of color. And yeah, like a red lip. Same uh, jewelry. Hermes bracelet. And um, yeah. I will be back with the bonus look very soon. As promised, I am back with the final look. And here it is. So this is in between like a more casual or more like business look. Um, I decided to leave it untucked to keep that like sort of casual vibe going. I'm just wearing it with a skirt. And I kept the same jewelry as in the last look. The same uh, dangling earrings and my bracelet. But um, I do want to just like highlight if you can't see it that well. All the cute little anchors on the shirt. Um, I think the thing that really makes summer is like a nautical theme. I just love that in clothing. So, um, yeah. And I was thinking about it, um, like I wore this shirt like two years ago, which seems like a million years ago now with um, everything happening. But it was a really good uh, evening out and like good food and good friends and yeah. I guess that's what I'm like trying to put out to anyone watching this video. So, happy fourth and Take care, stay safe, and uh, let me know if you had a favorite look from this little uh, lookbook collection. And I'll see you next time. Bye!